14, 700 horsepower, Roush supercharged, all tricked out. And this is, I, I got to behave on the street because I'm a rolling billboard, but. Uh, you wouldn't say that, but dude, as I look in here, you got a full cage in here, and it's such a nice truck. Is this one actually for sale? Is this one of your personals? You don't have anything personal. I know everything is for sale, isn't it? Maybe not this one. <laughs> really? They even surprised Mom over there. He's going to keep one. This is a nice truck, dude. I love the Raptors when they came out. And I'm sure you got a couple more in the stock, right? We have a bunch of the new ones. They're awesome. They went to the six-cylinder twin-turbo supercharged with a 10-speed automatic transmission. Super cool trucks. There's a debate whether the V8's better than the new six-cylinder. I'd go with the new one even with all the upgrades this one has. All on-road or off-road ready, and these things are... You, know, you have more than just Raptors. You have every Ford there at, at the uh, Blue Oval oh, Care in, in El Cajon Ford, don't you? No doubt. And if you say you're up here at Verona and you're a fan, you're now part of the El Cajon Ford family, come on down and tell us you're here, and we'll make the deal easy, sweet, best price you can get. Just mention El Cajon Ford and Verona Speedway. Well, thank you all. Thank you for all of your years of service and, and de dedication out here from El Cajon Ford for Verona Speedway. And I, can I dare you to see? Let's see what it's got in it. <laughs> Belt. Oh, yes. He's going to behave, but let's see what behaving's like. He was going to take this out to Del Mar and run it with the pro trucks in the off-road class. So. Paul Dyke, El Cajon Ford and the limited El Cajon Ford Raptor. That thing is such a sweet truck. Lucas, Lucas. <laughs> <laughs> Hit the wall, put a couple of yeah. <laughs> Michelle holding on the grab handle, Ooh, going for the ride. Have fun out there, buddy.